Junior Cert Geography, Chapter 1, The Earth, 1.4, Folding. These are the key words for this section of the chapter, and you need to know what each of these key words means. Syncline, Anticline, Alpine Fold Mountains, Armorican Fold Mountains, Caledonian Fold Mountains. Fold Mountains. Fold Mountains are formed when plates move towards each other and collide. The force of the plates pushing together causes the land above to buckle in folds, forming fold mountains. Figure 1.32 shows how fold mountains are formed. So here we have an example of the Nazca plate colliding with the South American plate. The Nazca plate is the heavier plate. So this section of the plate got pulled downwards below into the mantle where it would melt and turn into magma. These plates colliding with each other is caused from convection currents in the mantle. And the lighter plate, which in this case is the South American plate, would be folded upwards. It would buckle upwards. So fold mountains are formed by colliding plates. And this is the direction of the colliding plate. So the arrows are pointing towards each other because they are colliding. So the lighter plate was buckled upwards. It was pushed upwards and formed fold mountains. Now this, and this folding would happen over time. So figure 1.33 shows the downfold in a fold mountain is called the syncline. So this is the downfold here. So this part is known as the syncline or the downfold and the upfold is called the anticline. So this part here, the part that's pushed upwards is called the anticline. So this is known as the upfold. So the syncline is the downfold and the anticline is the upfold. So the part that's pushed upwards is the anticline. So here we have a photograph of a fold mountain. And you can actually see the folds in the photograph. So we can see this section here would be the anticline because it's pushed upwards. And this section here would be the syncline because it's pushed downwards. So we can actually see, if we look closely, we can actually see the folds. Periods of folding. There are three periods of folding that we're going to look at. And the first one is the alpine fold mountains. The world's Fold mountains were formed in three different periods. The Alpine fold mountains were formed 30 to 35 million years ago. They are the youngest and highest mountains in the world. They include the Rockies in America, the Alps in Europe, and the Himalayas in Asia. So they are the youngest and the highest mountains in the world because they haven't been weathered down yet very much. These mountains are very high as they've not been worn down by weathering. The next period of folding we're going to look at are the Armorican fold mountains. They were formed around 250 million years ago. They include the McGillicuddy Reeks in County Kerry. These mountains were once as high as the Alps, but have been worn down over time. They've been worn down by weathering. And we're also going to look at the Caledonian Fold Mountains. The Caledonian Fold Mountains were formed 400 million years ago. They include mountains in Donegal, Wicklow and Scotland. And now we're going to have a look at our Fold Mountain case study. Case study. The Munster Fold Mountains. The Munster Fold Mountains were formed 250 million years ago when the African plate collided with the Eurasian plate. They include the Galtes, the Knockmill Downs, the Comoras, and the McGillicuddy Reeks. They were formed during the Armorican period of folding. Figure 1.35, which is this one down here, shows the location of the Munster Fold Mountains. So here we have the McGillicuddy Reeks, the Galtee Mountains, the Knockmill Down Mountains and the Comer Mountains. These mountains were once much higher but they've been worn down over the years due to weathering. Figure 1.36 
shows us Caran Tuchel Mountain. Caran Tuchel is the highest mountain in Ireland. It is 1,038 metres tall. Here we have two photographs. The one on the left is a photograph of the Alps in Europe. And the photograph on the right is a photograph of the Knockmeal Downs, um, which are the Munster Mountains of Ireland. And it is interesting that they, the Knockmeal Downs were once as high as the Alps, but they have been worn down due to weathering.